saving Mr. Charlie's trees. Mr. Charlie came from poverty to plant a million trees and create a wildlife sanctuary he left to the University of Georgia for safekeeping. He was my uncle and a second father to me. This is about big money and the future of our world. My name is Charlie Terrell. I want, above all, to protect the earth from man's destruction. At present, I have accumulated a thousand acre tree farm and pretty well assured that I have a way to give it perpetuity. We've been very um, pleased to receive that gift. The Terrell track was in very good shape. We did decide that um, we would be better served by selling the property. To assure the earth and these trees that they will live forever. So uh, that property did finish selling. Uh, it was in three parcels and the last sold in the first quarter, I believe, of 2021. I am devoted to it, religiously devoted to it. It's a lot more important to me than my own life. What will happen to his trees and to the South? Right now, the South is the world's largest wood producing region. There's a rate and scale of industrial logging that is four times that of South American rainforest. And to the earth. As we continue to remove wildlife habitat from the landscape and we continue to increase as a society in size, it's going to be increasingly complex for sure. Can we still be heroes? The South has become the world's largest exporter of wood pellets. So it's a classic environmental justice issue right now playing out right now in Georgia. Trees, people, wildlife, climate, big money. Big Timber, come with me. Saving Mr. Charlie's Trees. <laughs>